Yes guys, welcome back to a brand new video, so as you can see by the title of this video, this is called A New Chapter in My Life. So, let's get going. Yes guys, welcome back to a brand new video, so, um, a new chapter in my life, people are thinking, wow, what's this new chapter? It's all about my videos, stay tuned. Well, when I say a new chapter about my videos, what I mean is, um, the content is going to get better, the video quality is going to get better, and the editing is going to get better. I'll show you. So when I say the quality of the video is going to get better, I'm not saying it's going to be all 4K, 8K, or anything like that. I'm meaning there's better quality of like content I'm going to make. So um, still the football videos, still the pre-match and post-match videos, but the football videos are going to be challenges and um, all the sort of stuff like football people like to watch and all that. And I've also had a rethink about the pre-match and post-match videos. I said in the pre-match video that um, all the pre-match and post-match videos are going to be edited. That's not true. Um, I didn't lie at that stage, but I just didn't know what I was going to think about. But now I've chosen. So um, now the pre-match videos, just the pre-match videos are going to be edited. The post-match videos are not going to be edited at all. And the reason is, it's just too much hard work technically and so now we have just got the pre-match videos to do so out this is how the pre-match videos are going to go so how the pre-match videos are going to go is i'm gonna so if there's a game let's say on saturday i'll film it on friday post it on friday and then so that's a day until the game starts so you get a feel for uh, the game and all that, uh, pre-match preparation and all that. But for the post-match, since it's not going to be edited at all, it's just going to happen like after the game. So if the game finishes at 10 o'clock, I'll post a video um, just after that, just a quick video about the post-match, about how the game went and all that. Probably likely from a minute to three or five minutes max. Um, but the pre-match video can be longer than that. But it'll... Pretty much video will get more into detail. Post match will just be this is how the game went. That's how the players went. Done. Get me. And then comes to the best part, the football videos. So as you know, when I post my football videos usually, it's from like one it's like ten seconds to a minute max, that's why it's in the shorts. But I want to do things differently. I want to make my videos each video I make, um, more than a minute, or a proper video, edited and all that. So the pre-match videos are going to be edited, and great, and so are the football videos. So then the football videos can be more challenges. Normally I would like hit a ball into a hoop, or just do some keep yuppies, but that's all going to change. Which does bring one factor in. If, what well, two factors actually, so if I post um, a football video... I probably won't post again on that day. Probably only one video a day. When it comes to when it's a pre-match video day. So on the pre-match video day, I'll um, just post the pre-match on that day. But I won't post any football matches on that day. The next day, when it's the actual game. So when it's the actual game day, that's the day after I posted the pre-match. I'll post a football video as well and afterwards I'll post uh, post match because post matches don't need editing at all I can just sit down here like I'm doing with you guys now record it and put it up myself and that's it usually when it's edited my editor puts it up for me all right you see where I'm going and so hopefully in a month or two or even like tomorrow I can get more views for videos that are longer than a minute because honestly the views don't count in the shorts. I'm not saying the views don't matter, yes, 47,000 views, thank you guys so much for that, but if it was a longer than a minute and it was 47,000 views, that would be more hours watched. So I need to get 4,000 watch hours, and right now I'm only at 20, even though I have videos that I've got 47,000, 10,000, 15, 25,000, that sort of thing. But since it's only shorts, it doesn't count to YouTube. So. So when I make the longer videos, those videos will count to the watch hours 
and then I'll get close to 4,000 and then hopefully I get 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year and then I can start getting paid and make even better videos for you. So when I get paid, I know I'm all blabbing about like, I want this money, I want that, I want this, I want that. I'm not really saying that. What I'm saying is when I get the money, I can make better videos for you. Like it can be um, so great, it could do um, football challenges with um, X players or something like that. X, Y, Z players or anything like that. And then I can make videos with other people, other challenges, um, and then grow my channel from there. And then I can show just my life and everything like that. And so hopefully you like that. Um, that's the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys like and subscribe down below. See you in the next video. Peace.